Hey guys, so I thought I'd do a quick video on the hamster binder, seeing as I've not done one in a while. Um, so basically, the hamster binder is now this because of before it was a blue one and the blue binder got like too small because I started putting like so much more information in there. So we just have like a list of videos which I'm going to try and do at some point. We then have a picture of a hamster. We have general information at the front. So I have the hamster expenses. So that's pretty much how much my hamsters cost me. Information on how to find a lost hamster. Sets in hamsters. Information about each of the different species. Indicators of old age in hamsters and how to look after older hamsters. Um, play and exercise information. How to tell the difference between a Campbell and a Winter White. This is really useful information because if I had no idea what the difference was until I actually like sat down and read through this. Um, information which I got from the Supreme website I think it is and it's actually really quite good information for hamster owners because of it also contains like common health problems within the information as well. Um, so then I just have like a bit of information on how to tell like what type of hamster you have based on you know like what they look like and what you need to look for in them so like you need to look at their fur, their size, ears, stuff like that so I thought that was really useful and I found it quite interesting to read so next we have health information and I have my A to Z on health problems in hamsters which I am currently updating at the moment so I don't have like everything in here but I'm actually sort of writing down and updating it and adding more things to that. So hopefully I should have a lot more information in there soon. We have fur colours. So we have Syrian colours. We have a lot of Syrian colour ones. A yellow divider, then we have more Syrian colours and fur types. That one doesn't have a picture and it wouldn't show up in my like software that I use to print it out with. Um, another divider which has Chinese hamster colours. Hybrid colours. Robovoski colours and then we have Campbell colours and we also have winter white as well. So then we have food and diet information. So we have just like a little bit of food information there about diets and supplement in their food and stuff. And then we have like stuff about treats in there as well. Then we have a list of safe foods for hamsters. Um, more safe foods. I do have like quite a lot of lists because of each list always contains different information on like every website. So we have safe and unsafe plants and flowers. Um, popular safe treats. Meat and protein foods. Um, other foods which can be fed. We have another little list of things there. Then we have homemade recipes which I've actually come up with myself and I also came up with like the names and stuff. So I might be doing like videos on these at some point. I'm not sure yet though. Um, what are you doing Tango? <laughs> Sleeping on the floor. Um, so we have them. And on my previous channel I did actually do videos on these so I might have to redo them because they did become quite popular. 
Um, then we just have the last recipe. And then behind this divider we just have a list of safe plants, vegetables, herbs and everything like that for rabbits because of... I did have a pet rabbit and unfortunately he got put to sleep. So I just still have that because if I did want to get another rabbit. And then we just have a list of all my pets which have sadly passed over to Rainbow Bridge. So there is quite a few of them. Um, and yeah, the rest of it is just those weird plastic things that you put paper in. Um, so that is my hamster binder. And there should be a lot more information going into that within the next few weeks. As there's going to be like quite a lot of health information. Um, hopefully more diet information as well. Um, so yeah. Thanks for watching guys, bye for now.